Hi, so in this video, we're going to connect to a license server. So we're going to set up the connection from my workstation to the license server, where I've actually got a Autodesk license, Network License Manager running with an Arnold 2020 license. Uh, so when I start out the Arnold License Manager, in my case, it's showing me the Network tab, which is where I want to be because I, I want to connect to the Autodesk Network License Manager. If I had a different kind of license, like an RLM license server I needed to connect to, I would switch to RLM, but I, I need to be on the network tab. So all I have to do is click add, put in the name of the license server with or without the at symbol. If we don't put it there, it'll automatic, automatically be added. The port, I don't have to put anything by default because my license server is using the default ports. Now, in some cases, some sites, your IT team or yourself, you may have had to modify the license file to use a specific port. So that port number would be on the server line of the license file. And in that case, yes, you know, if you were using 2755.8, you would have to pick that number. But in this case, as I said, I'm using the defaults. Um, unless I have some problem, I don't have to specify any port. This should work, work like in 98% of the cases. So in this case, yes, it worked. See it added the at symbol that I mentioned. It connected to the license server. You can see I have one license for 2020. Uh, the Arnold version here, that's just the version of Arnold that the Arnold License Manager is using. Um, so that's it, I'm connected. Uh, so now when I close the Arnold License Manager, this saving is gonna be saved for my user account. So I don't have to connect every time. Um, it's just gonna, every time I restart the machine and come back, uh, the connection information will be there for Arnold and Arnold's going to use it to get my license from that machine. And if I needed to edit it, I just click it, click edit. If I did need to change the port, add a different port later, I would do that. And that's it. 